and this might be a unique position in your career because the Kings aren't like the juggernaut, right? They're like the, you know, the hometowns, so even like your superstars, not like LeBron, right? Like you've coached LeBron, you've been in LA, you know, even your time with the Warriors, uh, you've seen teams kind of grow up. What are you looking for to know that, all right, this team will be able to handle this? Uh, and, and what did you see to make them think, all right, the beam is cute and we had the biggest, you know, we had the big audience for the playoffs. We went seven games with the Warriors, but it's another level. What made you think, all right, our team is ready for that? Well, the, the, the big thing is, is last year, just facing uh, the adversity to start the season. You know, we, we started the season 0-4. And, and usually if you have guys that don't believe <laughs> or that don't feel like they, that they can win or aren't winners, you're going to fold at that point. Uh, and especially with the history of the organization, you just going to give in and it's going to be a grind from that point on. And you may not even get to 500, but to see our guys continue to fight game after game after game. And then we pick up a tough win. I think it gets Miami first. Now we're one and four. And then I think we string off six or seven in a row, maybe something like that after that. To me, I'm like, okay, hey, this team has some fight. This team has some belief. And if they do with the skill set that they have, it's up to me to try to put them in the right position to see if we can take advantage of certain mismatches and things like that and play at our strength to get wins. And uh, so going through the year, uh, being around these guys game after game after game and seeing us grow in the right, to get, uh, right direction together and staying connected gave me the confidence that this could happen. And then seeing, being around Foxy, being around Domus, knowing that these guys have the potential to be uh, all-stars and maybe even better if everything around them was right. And now, you know, having the year we had, which was a good year, I don't, you know, everybody's like, oh, man, you guys had a great year. Oh, no, we had a good year. We're supposed to make the playoffs. <laughs> like, it's right, all right. right. It's all right. It's right. <laughs> We're supposed right. to make the playoffs, right? Yeah, <laughs> That's yeah. My going in. And so now – we have to take that next step to go from good to great. And, you know, a lot of people might say, hey, go ahead, this free agent. Go ahead, that free agent. Go. We're not at that stage yet. We, we got to see if last year uh, we found a nucleus for this team. You know, yeah. we, we, and, and then once you give that a chance to see if you have that, now that's when you can make your moves and your adjustments to help you even take another step maybe in year three. So yeah. that's kind of where we're sitting right now is after that 0-4 start to see our guys fight through that little bit of adversity and understand that they're still believing no matter what, I'm like, okay, I can rock with these 